I'm a 35 year old white man. Harrison has transracial identity, identifying as Harrison Booth, a 35 year old white man from Colorado. And when did you know that you were a 35 year old white man? I've always felt different. Uh, I go to the store and movies and just be thinking to myself, like, why am I not getting the respect I deserve? And then it just hit me. I'm white. I just, you know, here I pretend the buildings are the old San Juan mountain range, but, you know, the job's just hit. And where do you work? I'm a systems engineer for Coca-Cola. He go to school and that's it. Mm -hmm. One day he said, call me Harrison. I, who's that? Me. Do you? He is a white man. Is it? And I'd love to wake up one day and say, hey, everybody, I'm Rihanna. But I ain't. This baby just doesn't get it. You know, I try to get them to go out with me, go on walks, go to the farmer's market, chat with people, but yeah. So why don't you think that they get it? I don't think they get it because they don't realize that race is just a made up thing. Mm -hmm. They grew up having labels in me. I'm, I'm just not like that. I see. So how do you embrace your identity? A certain way. Patagonia. I wear a thick brown leather belt. I like to envision myself after the surgery. <clears throat> hey, excuse me, what IPA do you have on tap? Did you see Game of Thrones last night? So, you're... I started working at Stone Press Mall, so hopefully by then I have enough money to take the next step. Okay, Coca-Cola and the mall. Right, correct, I work at both. Harrison has been planning a full racial transition with the Dr. Samuel Vergara. The procedure's absolutely 100% possible. This is gonna look weird, though. It's pretty awesome, you know, you, you walk in the streets and black people, they see you, they're nod to you like, hey, good to see us. And it's, it's to the point where I've just given up. I've stopped trying to convince them that I'm not... <laughs>